girl. I'm also gonna take like. This book, y'all, this book is had to wait for the right time. Now it finally came. Whoa. This milk is froze. This is homemade milk. Oh, no. And I need to make a fresh batch of it. So I'm not putting in sea moss. And then collagen. I usually put in two teaspoons of this. Alright, and then usually I would do like a huge bag of strawberries. Well, not a huge bag. I would use just strawberries, but I don't have any frozen bananas. So, my babe picked this up for me. And it's like strawberries and bananas, but it's mostly strawberries. Well, no, this one actually has mostly bananas. So, the last pack had mostly strawberries. So, I'm gonna put a few of those in there. And then I'll do some strawberries. Also going to also gonna take like a banana. Ooh, girl. I'm also gonna take like this ripe fresh banana. I forgot to freeze my strawberries last night. I mean not my strawberries, I forgot to freeze my bananas. So we're using this. I think I'm gonna use about half banana since this one that pack has so many. Um, thousands in there. Move you guys over here so you can see me blending. Oh, this it's the angle for me. Like I gotta figure out a better. Actually, this isn't even really that bad. Perfect amount. Period. That's so good. Ooh, lighting. Why don't keys close the door? I don't. I. I don't. I don't get it. But guys, hi, hello, hola. Come, let's stop. How are you guys? So, if you're new here, my name is Ree. And wait, no, wait. It's like I haven't done this so long in so long. Like I don't I don't remember what to say. Welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Ree and I create conscious lifestyle content. Speaking of new people, like y'all, we literally just hit 20,000 subscribers like we <laughs> what? <laughs> what i'm not crying you are okay i'm not you are anyway i'm happy to have all the new people here if you guys haven't peeped the vibe yet this is a place of positivity positive vibes only so just keep that in mind when you're commenting watching for all the ogs you already knew that you you knew you already know 
how we gets down over here. But anyway, so today's video is just gonna be uh, I'm gonna say what I eat today, but that is not what we're doing today. We're doing like a vlog. I'm kind of gonna be like catching you guys up on what it is that I've been doing lately. Um, as you just seen, I made my smoothie because y'all know one thing about me. I'm gonna drink my smoothies. I'm gonna drink my juices. Period. Yeah, so speaking of smoothies, my last video, a lot of you guys were commenting asking for recipes. Now, if you guys have been here for a while, you know that I usually like put everything in the description box, but I was really short on time. By the time you're watching this, that description box should already be updated with recipes, ingredients, and everything like that. So my apologies for not including that information um yeah i feel like i have so much to tell y'all because it's just been so long but anyway um that's what we're gonna be doing today i'm gonna be kind of catching up with you guys um and sharing with them sharing with them sharing what i'm doing why is it so bright now and just sharing what i'm doing what i've been doing what i've been up to things i've been loving and you can see me in the mirror, that's fine. That's, that's completely fine. But, um, yeah, that's what we're doing. So before we move any further, I wanna to talk to you guys about today's sponsor, Skillshare. So what's really dope is that I was already using Skillshare before I even like, before they even hit me up and wanted to partner with me. So shout out to the universe for aligning me with brands who already fit into my lifestyle. So for those of you who aren't familiar with Skillshare, they are an online learning community for curious people, creative people who just wanna go ahead and take the next step in their creative journey. What I love the most about Skillshare is the fact that they have so many different topics. Anything from graphic design, illustration, productivity, self-care, plants. The classes that I've been really into, there's a class um, on plants, how to lift your spirit and your mood with Plants at Home by Christopher Griffin. I also, some of you may not know, but I have a background in like um, graphic design. Not so much digital art, so I was really interested in a class by Lacey Jordan on digital illustration. Yeah, like that was like the first class that I watched. Um, also watched a class on graphic design because also guys, I have a magazine that I have been working on, um, but there's always room for growth. So I'm always looking up different ways I can make myself better, not only for like, obviously personal reasons but also for my brand whether you are a beginner a professional a real working creative or if you're like me a lifelong learner just somebody who likes to continuously learn things and just grow overall Skillshare for you baby girl <laughs> something that's super dope for you guys is that the first 1,000 of my subscribers who click the link in the description box below will get a free trial of the premium membership so you guys can grow and expand and just get those creative juices flowing. So yeah, thank you Skillshare for sponsoring today's video. Also shout out to you guys for being here and tuning in with my content because if it wasn't for you guys, I would not be able to work with dope brands like Skillshare. Yeah, I won't let you down. We about to paint the town. Got the people all around. We've been surfing on the crown. Yeah, we don't cool kids with the roof down. Yeah, we let loose so lighten up. Break the rules now. Yeah, we wild. So what I've been doing, just a little life update, little catch up with y'all because it's been a while since I've actually like sat down and talked to y'all. Um, so what I've been doing is working on second issue of my magazine FTHH for the healthy hoes um yeah so here's the first issue if you guys aren't familiar here she is and I'm very very proud of it she go 
and just a little peek inside. Yeah, that's the first issue. Um, so what I've been doing and kind of the reason why I haven't been able to really just be consistent like that on YouTube, which I'm still trying to learn how to, okay, focus. Like we're not, we're not going to start this today. We're not, but, um, kind of the reason why I haven't been able to be consistent like I want to with pretty much all of my platforms. Um, cause I've been working on issue two called the black effect and i really really wanted it i had planned on it to drop in february it's currently midway through february my drop date was supposed to be february 19th and i just don't see that happening um tomorrow is literally february 19th and i'm still in the process of during doing the writing portion of it so i have like three interviews with different um women and i actually had a contributor this time also her name is sophie did she did such an amazing job and i really really appreciate her and yeah but i'm doing like the last article about mental health the mental health stigma in the black community and also guys there's a digital version um of issue one completely free and it's gonna be the same with um, the second issue, the digital issues are always free. So yeah, that's what I am working on in Neil. And I really need to go ahead and finish this article, which I'm almost done. And this article is, I just really, not this article, this issue is just so important. Like obviously every issue is important, but specifically this issue is called the black effect, like I said, and it's just about black people. African Americans, you know, I don't really want to like give like everything away obviously because I want y'all to go check it out But this issue was really dear near and dear to my heart Um So that said I just wanted to make sure that it was done the right way and I didn't want to rush I didn't want to have to rush because like I said, I wanted to be done the right way and at the end of the day I am my own boss but I did set that deadline for myself. And for me, whenever I don't, even though nobody else knew that deadline, I knew it. So it's just like, I kind of was beating myself up about it. But at the end of the day, I need to give myself more credit. Like I do so many different things and I just got to learn how to give myself enough credit, but at the same time, hold myself accountable. Still learning that. Anyway, that's what I've been working on. Still trying to balance everything. Yeah. But I'm excited for you guys to see this issue. Like I said, this is the last article that I have to do. Also, there's a playlist, obviously, because... Do I even have to explain? Um, Yeah. And then I can start the design process, which doesn't take me very long um, at all. Maybe like three to four days. It don't take me that long to do it. Like a, maybe like a week. So... Hopefully this will be out by February because like I said, it is a magazine that's about black people, black history, the history of black wellness and like just how we've evolved and how to continue evolving and grow. Um, so hopefully I can have it out by the end of the month. But if not, I tell myself like that's completely fine too. Like that's okay too, sis. We're going to take our time with this and make sure it's bright. So yeah, that's what I've been doing. Um, and I will check with you guys, check back with you guys in a little bit. So I also wanted to show you guys some things that I've been loving health wise. Um, so I actually, obviously I've been taking C, but I just, I stopped for a while and I started back taking it again. Um, this just came in like earlier this week and absolutely love C, prebiotic, probiotic. I'll make sure I link everything down below. Um, just started using this as well collagen protect as well as beauty dust dust for like skin hair and nails and stuff like that been adding these to my smoothies you guys see me add this this morning actually what's crazy is i am a part of like their monthly gifting program but i must have forgot that i was and i actually paid for these with my own money but i should have some more coming in um that was sent to me so yes yeah, super in love with this 
also was gifted this from gold but again i was already using gold um and purchased it with my own money before this was actually sent to me and then this is something that i actually just bought and i have not tried it yet but i've heard a lot of good things about organic olivia um about this brand in general this is a digestive juice like i've never actually heard anything like this so basically they're just herbs to get your digestive system going to kind of reduce bloating and everything like that this company also has a probiotic like i said i really like seed but i really want to try theirs too so as far as price goes they're kind of in the same ballpark but except for you have to like this is like a monthly subscription thing where as to this one i think you just purchase it um when you run out so definitely want to try out the probiotics because i've heard really really good things and also just sharing things i love i've been reading this book y'all this book is so good like like i said earlier like i'm trying to um like get out of old habits i literally journaled yesterday and i was just telling myself like bro you keep doing these things that you used to do and like as far like i used to really literally binge youtube videos and and i used to really be interested in what other people are doing and like and i mean obsessed this was me about two three years ago and i mean really obsessed to the point where like i was almost this is gonna sound really weird but like where i was almost living their life like i would picture it as my life and that's really not good because i would kind of compare their lives to mine and obviously everybody's life is unique and you should want you should love your own life obviously have people to look up to for inspiration and and motivation and things like that but ultimately you want to dig inside of yourself further expand like what am i trying to say you want to dig inside of yourself for joy and for happiness and for growth so that being said every time i go to like click on a youtube video it's out of habit and i do it because like i said it's what i've always done but like i end up watching like one minute literally one minute of the video and clicking out of it because like i'm bored like it's not satisfying me anymore and i'm in i'm in a i'm really in a good place right now where i am accepting of my life my current situation grateful for my life for all the things that's happening for me and for the things that will happen for me i'm super super grateful for all of those things and happy that i'm just in a space and i'm in talking to you guys able to hopefully inspire and motivate you all to look inside of yourselves to just grow in be happy um with who you are and the reality that you have manifested manifested and will continue to manifest so that being said i've really been into like i've always read but more so was just like self-help books and spiritual books which i still do that but i've really been on like fiction books here lately and this book is so good and it's just so relatable just i think we all talk about relatability in a sense that like likeness like if you're like that person but this book is just relatable in the sense of like the way she speaks the way she writes her language the 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 words that she uses like are literally words that i would use so yeah like i really really like this book basically this book is about gentrification in new york city um actually i think she's in brooklyn and she's just looking in her neighborhood and neighborhood and realizing like nobody who was there is there and i believe this book is written from the perspective of two different people sydney and theo and i'm like not that far into it probably like one third within to one third into the book so um it's really funny really um entertaining so i highly highly recommend this book oh my gosh oh my god i feel like i have so much to share with y'all oh my god this was i literally i cannot take a break this long again because it's like i'm kind of like throwing everything at y'all at once so it's kind of almost like information overload but like i just got i gotta share i have to not sure why my new journal is so dirty but guys i i ran out of pages in my old journal literally so i started my old journal which let me go grab it 
why are all my journals dirty? So I started this journal literally March 20, March 20, hold on, let me go back and look what it say. March 2020. So at that point, I was just, and I went back and read like the first page and I was just at such a different space in my life. And it's just so exciting that I literally filled that journal up. So that, I don't know why, but that's super exciting to me. I was able to purchase a new journal. I watched the movie Soul with my family. It's on Disney Plus. It was so good. So basically the main character, which is played by Jamie Foxx, um, he is a starving artist he is i think he plays the piano and he's teaching this he, he's a teacher he teaches like music or band i don't know and um basically from after watching that movie like i just really felt like i needed to just live more i feel like we're all always focused on like something in the future um or like the outcome of a thing but that movie really taught me to just continue to live in the present and just be grateful for the memories that I do have and the memories that I'm gonna make but yeah all in all just taught me to my hair look really crazy y'all like I'm sorry um really all in all just really taught me to live in the moment be present so yeah I highly recommend that movie so one other thing I want to show y'all a tea press! Looky! So cute! So first of all, it's a ceramic tea press that I bought on Etsy. It's so beautiful. So pretty. So essentially, I think this is a coffee press, but I think that you can use coffee press and tea press for the same thing. I personally, I personally don't drink coffee. I just, I've never liked the taste of it. Um, the caffeine really does something to my stomach in my digestive system so I just like don't pull with coffee but I'm really trying to get my loose leaf herb game up but there's one thing that I have to show y'all y'all this Clur Gentle Matter Daily Moisture Cleanser wait wait you can't even you really can't see like cause the lighting is reflecting off but I took some really cool photos so I'll insert them in now but y'all I've been using this for like a week. I know, I know, I know. I know what you're gonna say. I know. First of all, this is vegan, cruelty free, all natural, no, preserv no preservatives or anything like that. So that's really dope. Also black owned, so that's super dope. I know, I know what you're gonna say to me. I know. I've been using it for a week and my skin, oh, it just feels different. So before I was using Youth to the People and I do like Youth to the People. I have, I still love them, but I have really dry, sensitive skin. And after using Clare, my skin just like, it feels different. It does not feel dry. It does not feel itchy or like, you know, or tight or anything like that. So I have to say that Clare is my, new go-to and it's just like the aesthetics the packaging everything like so guys if you can i highly recommend that you try clur so good i'm gonna say this and then i'm gonna get to work do some mommy things etc etc but i used to be really weird when it came to like sharing stuff because in the past as someone who watched content and like see see content on instagram and youtube it's just like you never really know if people are being genuine and especially like when these people get like pr packages and everything like that but i had to really tell myself that first of all if that is the case that's their business secondly i am not those people everybody in my community knows that i only even if it is a sponsor of content like I only work with brands who align with me, who I am as an individual and what my brand is. And it's the same, obviously if it's like that with sponsored content, it's gonna be like that with um, brands who wanna send me things or even with when I just organically buy things. I'm just a person like, and that's what I have this platform for to share, also to share my journey, but also to just share like things that I'm into at the moment. So. I gotta get out of my head when it comes to just like sharing things. I'd love to know what you guys' thoughts are about me just sharing things, whether it be a product, an experience, 
yeah just comment down below and let me know how you feel about that um just curious i also feel like i also feel like i've been talking y'all head off today but it's completely fine but um i had a lot of resistance and anxiety when it came to vlogging today i've been putting it off for so many days um but i'm actually glad i did pick up the camera and talk to you guys because i feel like i'm in my zone like it puts me in such high spirits and I, my energy is just so pure and so I have so much joy when I pick up my camera and vlog and just connect with y'all so say all that to say that happy I finally did fight the resistance and pick up my camera because I love y'all I do It's feeling right, it's like a million Nothing in the way, yeah, yeah It's like a flip the switch, the light is really on Cruising through the day, yeah, yeah, yeah Ooh, it's so deep in the way I feel Way I feel Ooh, it's so love now I'm feeling here Feeling here Turn it on This, sir. No. We had no part to this. So here we have some under all of this you can there's like a mixed what is it called? Mixed greens. Mixed greens, yeah. Mixed greens. Then we have the roasted veggies, the broccoli, fries, and bell peppers, barbecue chickpeas topped with avocado. It's like one of our go-to things to make. 